What's up fish catcher Jacoby viewers? So on today's video is going to be another kind of a compilation. Uh, we went on a little vacation um, last weekend uh, uh, for a few days. Didn't really have much time to fish. Uh, didn't really plan around it that great. But uh, we might be going back in a few weeks. I'm not really sure. So I, I did a little beach fishing in the evening for about an hour. I caught a couple fish. And then on the uh, other part, so we do a little saltwater fishing first, guys. And then the next part, we're going to go uh, do some bass fishing towards the end of the video. I just wanted to let you all know that was going because I obviously didn't get enough footage with only fishing in an hour. But either way, guys, stay tuned. Uh, it's a good video, and I hope you all enjoy. Damn. Oh no, I got him. Yes, sir. Oh, big ugly. What is that? A ladyfish? <laughs> That's not what we wanted, folks. Look at that big old ladyfish. God, he swallowed it. Well, that's not what we want unless I was shark fishing. Then I definitely want them. Would you look at that big old ugly ladyfish? Man. I'm down here on vacation right now. Uh, oh, wrong way. Trying to. Got it. I found a second to go fish for a little bit. While I was on vacation, I might go early in the morning and uh, started off. Got a little Z Man shrimp on. Wasn't expecting that ladyfish. But started off with. Uh, my lure's all jacked. Oh well, it does the thing. Started off uh, fishing with a diesel minnow and it's kind of hard to see in the water but i've had one flounder chase me all the way up but he wouldn't take it so i figured it would be some ladies out here i wasn't expecting to catch one but... the ball. he's on got him yeah boy let's go got it <laughs> Woo! let's go boy Ah! let's go yes sir guys i've missed several i have missed several and i mean i have missed several of these fish dang he swallowed it there he goes Woo! hold on When I say I have missed several of these little gulf flounders, I have missed several guys. And I finally found a way to catch them. Had a bluefish, I'm assuming, cut me off. Had a nice little, you know, uh, what you do? You, I just came out here for a little bit and look at that. Beautiful gulf flounder. I've never actually caught one because I've never fished the beach like this. Let's get this shot of him going. Oh, wrong way. Look at him go. Woo. Yes, sir. Give a little shout out to Bama Beach Bum for that. I'd have never thought about coming out here. I mean, I always knew they were flounder here, but I'd never even thought about coming out here and trying to fish for them with lures until I watched Bama Beach Bum do it. All right. I don't think that was close to a keeper, but the Gulf Flounder, uh, they don't grow very big, I believe, so. But they ate this little Z-Man. What is this? A Z-Man. Uh, scented shrimp. See if we can't get another one. There he is. Oh, there it is. First pass, baby. Not a big one. That would actually make great bait if there were some uh, four pounders up in here. I know there are, but they're hard to find. You don't really see them come out of the wood as much. Here we go. See, I'm not really sure what these are. They're either a spotted bass or an Alabama bass. I'm going to have to, uh, when I leave here today, let that truck go by. When I leave here today, I'm going to have to do a little research because uh, they've got that little spot on their patch on their tongue like a spotted bass. But either way, off he goes. Make a nice little aquarium bass.
Oh, he got it, didn't he? Yeah, if one's got it. Too small. He's too small, though. No, he ain't. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Finally. Oh, he threw my brim somewhere. Oh, well. I'll just have to wait till I catch more bait. <laughs> oh, no. I gut hooked him. Daggummit. Hmm. Let's see here. How bad he's hooked. Oh, he's fine. Let me get this hook out. Oh, he'll be all right. It got him a little bit, but I think he'll live. Oh, yeah. He's bleeding a little bit, but honestly, it wasn't in his gut. It just caught his first little gill plate out of uh, six of them, five of them, so he should be okay. But we'll get him back in the water real fast. Oh, yeah. He'll be all right. He threw my brim off. I know that. Finally. Not the one I'm after, but <laughs> fun either way. All right, guys. Looks like we got some uh, minnows in the trap here. Got a couple of them, I believe. I'm going to go ahead and take these guys out and get started here. Oh, yeah, we got a few shiners. Boy, let's go. Look at this little bitty toad, guys. Got him on the shiner. Well, looks like we're a little bitty city today. We caught that other little one on a little brim. But look at this toad, guys. Look at this little football of a fish right here. Man, that's not what I was expecting. Let's get a quick release on him. Woo, he's gone. So, that's number two. Or is that number three? I'm not really sure. We broke off a couple of times. We missed a nice bass earlier. It's probably a couple pound bass. I rehooked it a different way. I rehooked it in the body just because uh, I did earlier. I uh, I missed that nice one. It's like he knew the hook was there. Probably he probably felt it and he ate it all the way up to the head. I was gonna give him another second to try to get that hook, but he was going under some wood and he would have definitely. Uh, messed me up if I would have left them in there in that wood and I would have got snagged but that's why we rehooked it differently guys I know there's some big ones in here have we've seen them and they swiped at my stuff but I have not seen them again That little bass couldn't have been hungry. Oh, there he is. Oh, man. That was a nice bass. That was a pound and a half bass. How did I miss that? They feel this hook. This hook is not big. It's only a two-aught. I don't really want to go any smaller. I think I have a one-aught. But, dang, man. He had it in his mouth. I had to pull again. I guess I could have probably gave him another second. I can't believe he didn't get a hook in them. That was a nicer one, finally. How come I can catch these little bitty fellas? Oh, but I missed the big ones. There's a nice one. I changed my mind. I got him that time. Oh, no. How, dude? Well, that got good footage. That, was a, that one was of a couple pounds for sure. <laughs> Daggummit, dude. How did I miss that one? That was, that was a nice bass. That was the one we were looking for, folks. But, I mean, that's the way it goes. You catch some, you lose some. He wanted it. He smacked it as soon as it hit the water. I can't believe he didn't get snagged. Oh, there's another one. Oh, what the heck? Well, that sucks. Hooked myself somewhere. <laughs> That's all right. Only problem is I got to go make a walk to get more bait. 
and now I've hooked myself. Those were some nice bass. Oh, fish catcher Jacoby. He don't know how to hook fish, that's for sure. All right, folks, we'll be back. All right, guys, that was officially the end of the video. Uh, like I said, I was only out there for about an hour, and I caught that one little gulf flounder. That was my first fish, like I said. Uh, I missed actually several of them. Obviously, I didn't put in the video. I uh, watched one follow me all the way up to the bank. Uh, so uh, I'm definitely going to get back out there. They're going to be out there all summer. Uh, and uh, I think, like I said, I'm going to be back out there in a few weeks. I just don't know how this heat wave is going to affect them. But, I mean, they're out there. So, I mean, uh, but then in a few weeks, it might even be even hotter unless we get some rain and uh, some north wind blowing in. But either way, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button. Help me support the channel, and it's your boy, Fish Catcher Jacoby.